Hey, my guest today is Chelsea. Chelsea's in her second year here at Grand Canyon. She's from San Diego, California. So you were here for chapel this morning and heard Albert speak. Tell us a little bit of what you experienced and what your thoughts are about his message. Um, it was amazing. Like I think that was one of the best chapels that I've been to. Um, I think that he, because he went over John 3.16 a lot of the time, that is so like just passed over right away. Like um, It's written on everything and um, non-believers see it all the time and don't really know the meaning of it. So I think it was really cool to have this arena packed with people and um, believers and non-believers hearing that. And I think it's really cool how he really dug into that verse rather than just skipping over it and moving on to how to be a Christian is really what it means um, that Jesus died on the cross for us. You know, Albert's becoming a new friend of GCU. Uh, he was referred to us by a friend of the university and they really encouraged me to invite Albert to come to campus. He said he's a gospel-centered pastor. So we were hearing a little bit about his church uh, that he pastors in Southern California. And uh, all he could talk about was how important it is to them to be gospel-centered. Yeah. So uh, your home is in San Diego. You've been here for two years. What are you studying? Nursing. You Nursing. So you got yeah. a big load. Yep. Yeah. I'm also a life leader too, so it's a big load. <laughs> You're a life leader in what dorm? Uh, Chaparral. Chaparral, it's how's really, it going? It's great to see what the Lord is doing here on this campus. Like, I, I saw it last year, but this year it's in a whole different way of being a leader, and um, the Lord is just moving, and the Holy Spirit is so on this campus. It's amazing. Well, Chelsea, thank you for uh, taking some time to talk to us today, but also thank you for serving on campus. Uh, what you do as a life leader is absolutely transformative to this campus. The difference you're making in the girls in your hall, in the dorm, around campus, uh, only God knows. So thank you for doing that. Yeah. <laughs> thank Thanks you. for joining us. See you next week.